In this video, I'm going to share with you the key to powerful transformation, to true transformation. For a while, I felt stuck. For a while, I felt like I wasn't getting anywhere fast. For a while, I was having blocks in my manifestations and I wasn't seeing real change in my life. And it came from this one principle that I'm going to share with you in this video. And by the time this video ends, you're going to know how to apply this key in your own life for powerful, powerful transformation, which will allow you to manifest the life that you truly want to live, which will allow you to manifest anything that you're desiring in your experience. Check it out. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to Meditation with Christopher. Now in this video, I'm going to share with you something that was a real game changer for me. And I believe that it's going to be the game changer for you as well. When you actually start applying this in your life, and when you just come to this awareness, because that's really what it is, it's coming to a new awareness about reality and coming to a new awareness about who it is that we are. Because the truth is, we have a story that we tell ourselves each and every day about how reality works, about how our life is, about who it is that we are. We have a story about what we're capable of, what we're able to achieve, the things that we want to attract and manifest in our life. We have certain beliefs about them, right? And a lot of this comes from our self-image or the way that we view ourselves, our, our personal identity, all right? And that's what this video is going to be about. That's the main key to transformation, to true transformation, is about realizing that your life is flexible and you, your, re, your outer reality is malleable because your life literally is a blank slate mirror reflecting your internal condition and your energetic vibration. Your life literally is equal to your thoughts, your feelings, and your actions. And if you view yourself as somebody who doesn't accomplish much, if you view yourself as somebody who is only capable of doing this, who is only capable of doing that, if you view yourself as somebody who is unable to live the life that they desire because it's too hard, or because this, and because that, and you keep coming up to blocks within yourself, right? Well, this is going to be one of the main reasons why you're not seeing real transformation in your life because if you want to see a change in your life you got to start making changes from within right because if I come up to this mirror right here in the bathroom right and I come up to this mirror and I want to place my hands on the mirror if I want to change what I'm seeing on this mirror right I can't press my hands on the mirror and start smudging it around and expect to change the reflection that I'm getting in the mirror right but what you got to do is you got to look within Start changing yourself from within. Start changing yourself from a vibrational level. Start changing the way that you view yourself or your self-image and realize that your personality is flexible. And when you realize that your personality is flexible, you realize that your reality is flexible as well. And you literally could be, do, or have anything that you want in this reality and in this experience if you allow yourself to do so, right? So what I'm sharing with you here is really the game changer for many people. It's about realizing that you got to make a new choice about who it is that you are and stick to that identity. We get stuck in certain identities. We get stuck in certain vibrational patterns. And this is why we do the same things every day. We think the same thoughts every single day and we get the same results in our life every single day. And it's because of our personality. It's because we think that our personality is fixed when really everything in our life, nothing is fixed. You know, nothing is stuck. A lot of times this is just what we believe, right? So the main key to transformation, to, to seeing real transformation in your life, is about making a new choice about who it is that you are. Changing yourself from a vibrational level, which means lining up your thoughts, your feelings, and your actions with the version of you that you prefer to be. Right, because like I was saying before, your life literally is a blank slate mirror reflecting your internal condition and energetic vibration. All right, your life literally is a blank slate mirror just reflecting back to you what you believe to be true. This is also going to connect to what I've been sharing in my videos a lot. Right, that's called shifting into parallel realities, because really quantum physics and quantum mechanics is showing us this now that. There literally are an infinite amount of realities. In every single moment, you are shifting into an entirely new reality. Every single moment, you are shifting. Right now, you're shifting. Right now, you're shifting. Right now, you're shifting. And you are who you choose to be in the present moment. That's the key here, 
is to realize that you are who you choose to be in the present moment. And given there are infinite amount of realities, right, like how I'm walking around in this video in the house, you know, just kind of showing you around, right? All right, I could have went in that direction. I could have went in this direction. I could have went in that direction, right? These are all potential realities that exist, right? So if we realize this and we realize that there are infinite amount of realities and that we are who we choose to be in the now and in the present moment, well, then all we have to do is make that personal shift within ourselves, make that identity shift about who it is that we are, make a new choice about who it is that we are and just decide that this is who we are now. This is who we are now. This is who we are now. And this is the main reason why people come up to spiritual blocks when they try to manifest certain things, why people come up to spiritual blocks when they try to do certain things in their life that don't really resonate with them. It's because you still view yourself as this old version of you. You still view yourself as this person who is incapable of doing this, incapable of doing that. And that's why you keep coming up to spiritual blocks whenever you try to do certain things. Right? It's going to come from you making a new choice about who you are and changing yourself from a vibrational level before anything else. Before you even see the physical evidence. You see all the physical stuff in your life. Right? This, this is actually barely even true because it's just temporary. It's a temporary reflection of your vibration. Right? So half the time when I see physical stuff in my life, I don't even take it to heart. You see, the key is to not let external conditions govern your, your internal condition. Not let the external govern the way that you feel within. And if you can just start doing things for the sake of it being aligned with who it is that you really are, right? stop doing things to get somewhere else. Start doing things because it's a reflection of who it is that you really are. Well, you'll start seeing real transformation in your life because it's not going to come from out there. The, the true transformation is going to come from you looking within and changing your personality or more so aligning to the frequency and the vibration, right, which means your thoughts, your feelings, and your actions, aligning this to the version of you that you prefer to be, okay? Aligning it to the version of you that you prefer to be and realizing that, again, you are who you choose to be in the now, Reality is completely flexible, but it's going to connect to our beliefs. It's going to connect to our beliefs about reality, our beliefs about ourselves, our beliefs about the way that reality works. All right? And this is what I've been noticing with the Mandela effect, too. If you guys heard of the Mandela effect, I'm sure you have. This connects to parallel reality shifting. It's, it's, the, it's the truth that there are an infinite amount of timelines, and when you make a new choice about who it is that you are, you shift to a different timeline and can create a, a different potential reality or future for yourself, All right? So realize that the true transformation comes from within. It's going to come from you making a new choice about who you are. It's going to come from a personality or an identity shift, All right? And making a new choice about who, who it is that you are and aligning to this every single day and just deciding that this is who you are now, this is who you are now and sticking to that vibration, and sticking to that frequency. And then you will see the real changes in your life, and they will happen naturally as a byproduct of you being who it is that you really are, right? So all this stuff will come easier when you align to the frequency of the version of you that you prefer to be. It won't take as much effort to manifest and attract the things that you want to in your life because you're feeling good in the present moment, you're in alignment, you're doing things for the sake of them being a, a reflection of who it is that you really are. And that's when you're going to see the true transformation in your life, all right? Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave a thumbs up if you did. And let me know if you like this uh, shooting style where I'm walking around a little bit. Let me know if you enjoy that. <laughs> but other than that, peace, love, and namaste. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> Later.